Let me go crazy. Have you ever been close to an NJP? I listen. I was so close to an NJP, I could smell that motherfucker breath. <laughs> You will be there. What was your day-by-day -day motivation to put on the uniform, bro? Mr. Bojangles. Um, so my day-by-day -day motivation to put on my uniform was the Uniform Code of Military Justice, right? There's a thing in there called UA Unauthorized Absence. Meaning, for those of you who may not know what that means, if you don't put that motherfucking uniform on and show the fuck up to work, you will be held accountable. Now, being held accountable could be anything. It can range from a negative counseling. It can range from 45, 45, or 60 days maxed out, or your ass can be pushed out. Two type of men. I'm a black man and I'm a man. There's women making podcasts about black men and women making podcasts about men all together. You see what the fuck we got to deal with in America? It's a real good question. That that's that pizza in elementary school, that goddamn that damn rectangle pizza with the little like five pieces of sausage on that motherfucker. That motherfucker used to hit with the chocolate milk. Hit. And don't and then they used to have the core man. Marines can do with bare minimum. You got damn right. Sleep in a phone booth. Put a lock on that motherfucker and sleep standing up. <laughs> yeah, but yeah, if you would have seen me like five months ago, bro, man, I was stressed the fuck out, bro. Like, oh, man. Yo, when you in a dark place, man, and you finally get out of that shit, yo, that shit is everything, bro. Like, just because a man will fuck you, does not means he will marry you. After you've been in so many failed relationships, you have to ask yourself, are you really wife material or are you just fuckable? That's genuine content creators I know. Base, I appreciate that, man. That's a real love. We say real love. Ah! searching for something like that that's how she, i think that's what she meant because in the marine corps you get um histed where you're forced to do a b billet which is recruiting or drill instructor or uh embassy duty or um an mct combat instructor and i felt like i was going to be forced to be a recruiter and i was going to no longer be happy because i was going to be um I was I wasn't going to, it wasn't going to be fulfilling anymore. I was going to be busting out skits and being overworked to overhaul the shortage of recruitment for the Marine Corps and not be properly compensated for it. Are you voting for Trump? <laughs> Nigga, I ain't even voting. <laughs> God damn. Hey, look, I ain't even vote. Bitch, I ain't never voted before. I'm about to, I'm about to be 28. I, done, I was in the military for three different presidents. And you know what's crazy about that? You know what's crazy about that? I didn't vote for neither one of them motherfuckers. So at the end of the day, I can talk shit. Because I ain't vote for none of them. You did. So when the country fucked up, don't be like, man, he fucking it up. You're the reason he fucking it up. You put him there. Bullshit. You need to come fuck with me over on the smoke pit, man. I do it at 10 p.m. Eastern time, 7 p.m. Pacific time, Monday through motherfucking Sunday. Yeah, you just seen them clips. You missing out. Shit, as long as we tracking.